Judaism does not command us to believe, it commands us to remember. The commandment of faith in the Torah is remember, that you may remember the day of your departure from the land of Egypt as long as you live. There is a slow and silent stream, a stream not of oblivion but of memory, from which we must constantly drink before entering the realm of faith. The substance of our very being is memory, our way of living is retaining the reminders, articulating memory. The true story of the mind is not preserved in learned volumes, but in the living mental organism of everyone. The riches of a soul are stored up in its memory. This is the test of character, not whether an individual follows a daily fashion, but whether the past is alive in the present. When we want to understand ourselves, to find out what is most precious in our lives, we search our memory. Memory is the soul's witness to the capricious mind. We are a people in whom the past endures, in whom the present is inconceivable without moments gone by. The vision of the prophets lasted a moment, a moment enduring forever. What happened once upon a time happens all the time. Jews have not preserved the ancient monuments. They have retained the ancient moments. The light kindled in their history was never extinguished. With sustaining vitality, the past survives in their thoughts, hearts, rituals. Recollection is a holy act. We sanctify the present by remembering the past.